Somewhere along the lines, in my vast running shoe career, I came across something that I really love to do, and that is helping runners get out of their own way of, you know, issues with their body so that they can run pain-free, as fast as they want to be able to run. The most interesting thing that I found in doing this for 10 or so years is that rarely, even I would say less than 5% of the time, do I ever talk about their running shoes. Sure, if they ask me to go shopping with them, I'll go shopping with them and help them find a running shoe. But in general, I watch the way they run, look at their body mechanics, suggest adjustments that need to be made, but rarely are those adjustments a running shoe. So here I am talking about running shoes all the time, that's what you want to hear from me, yet it's rarely the running shoe that is the answer to what you need in running. My example today is a good friend of mine. He's a good runner. In fact, he and I ran, ran and walked 32 miles the other day. So he's a, he's a good runner and he's qualified for Boston and he wants to be able to do the Leadville 100. And so he asked me to watch him run and give him some pointers. And in the video, he has some things that are going on in his body that are limiting his ability to run as well and as fast as he wants to run. And so I, get, I watched what he was doing and I've given him pointers. So Andrew here has two very tight hips and you can see that by the way his feet turn out as he takes a stride. His hips are not rotating correctly so his feet turn out. But his left hip is a lot worse than his right hip and in fact his left hip is so bad that he takes a shorter stride, his foot turns out more and this causes him issues. If you've got questions about this video or running shoes in general or your running shoe, leave comments below. I'd be happy to answer. I try to answer every single comment that's there. Thanks a lot for watching. Share this video with anybody you think needs it. Have a great run.